Hello. Hello. Is anybody there? Hello, Les. Are you here to renew your membership? No. I'm here to cancel my membership. Oh, dear. No, I have been on some of the worst dates in history. I've met people with whom just talking is more arduous than walking to Mount Doom and back. And you people are to blame. I'm sorry, but you have to wait a while first. You too, huh? Uh, no, I'm more of a queen man myself. What? Don't worry. Did I just hear you say you're cancelling your membership? I don't know. Did you hear that? You're feeling rather grumpy, aren't you? Well, let me see. I am not dopey, not sleepy, not bashful, not dog. Yes! I'm grumpy. Join the club then. Ten of the worst dates you'll find outside the discount fruit merchant. Whoa, you've really been on ten dates with these people. That certainly puts my view into perspective. Oh, why can't I just get out of my bag and find someone really right for me? Oh, I've got something wrong with me. Are you kidding me? You've got something wrong with you. I am the one that's got something wrong with me. I went through hell just because I was too desperate to find someone in a normal way. You see, it's difficult. At what point does it go from being patient to being desperate? I don't know. I think it's different for each person. Or maybe it's all just luck. Yeah, it always seems that way in the movies, you know. You could find the perfect person, but they might not be right for you. I know. I mean, you might, they might be right for you, but you might be wrong for them. And, or they just might never notice each other. <laughs> it's funny how many people you'd see sitting right next to each other, but they never really notice how good they are for each other. You can have two people right next to each other with so much in common, it'd just be stupid not to take the chance. <laughs> when you're finished blandly moralising, maybe we can get somewhere. We'll continue this later. Hmm. So let's go through your details then. You must have the wrong file here. All the dates you were on are completely in accordance with what I have in folder. It says here you describe yourself as highly open-minded and willing to look at new types of romance. Well, that hardly extends to changing my entire sexuality. You have very strong views on political and social issues. But not the type that result in mass genocide. Would prefer to meet a younger woman. Well, you know, that's a common request. Uh, your fault or something shallow airhead. You are all you are also apparently very religious. Well, that might be stretching the truth just just a little bit. Furthermore, you want to meet someone within my own field of work, which is listed here as high up in the legal profession. Uh no point, I have the right to remain silent. It just gets more baffling when we go to the physical description. Ah, uh -huh. oh well um I'd rather not talk about that in front of us. Six foot with blonde hair and blue eyes. That would explain why I'm Mrs. Hitler. A dedicated bodybuilder, very image conscious. And that would explain the teenage cliche. Traditional good looks. Well, you know, there are some people that say I look like something out of a work of art. Yeah, maybe a screen. What? And most interestingly here, Emma Watson was apparently your ex. You should do this, Lyle! I'll be back in a moment with your details, miss. Erica, are you going to join us, darling? I know I'm doing that. I pay. Uh, what? That's another thing, though. Does she really pay you? Uh, why? Well, you tell us. Mm. Yes, that bit wasn't in silo. Uh, no, 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 I get it. She, she means the bills, don't you? Yes, she, she's very independent, like you said. Uh, she wants to spend absolutely everything down the middle. Bills, chores. Oh, it sounds wonderful. Very Jackie Collins. I pay, I spend. It's not very chivalrous, her having to pay. Yeah, yeah. Yes. This is the new Leo, Leo, Leo. You don't own anyone, and no one owns you. I think it's inspired. Yes, but I'm not sure that's the kind of outlook we want from Lindsay. We like her meant to be gentlemen. Business. 
makes her colours. I have a bit of birthmark on my lower back, but you tell me it's cute. Mm. Ah! Oh, yes, they're, they're very thorough in the entertainment business. Well, we went to Blackpool a month ago for a romantic weekend and kissed on the big one. Oh, isn't that when you went to Blackpool? Uh, yes. So you was there as well with this man and Erica? Oh, um, the three of you had a romantic weekend in Blackpool, and what is all this about a big one? Oh, <coughs> no, 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 it's, it's a roller coaster ride. Oh, it sounds like non-stop action. No, 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 it's, it's just, give me that. Oh, no, oh, 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 I'm so sorry, you're not dressed. Oh, you're not dressed. Yes, um, come on, come on into the kitchen and we can get a dance cloth. This way. It's this way. Um, but of course you know that, living here. Thank you. 